The Caribbean Digital Transformation Project, with funding support from the World Bank, moved a step closer to reduce the digital divide for clients of the St. Lucia Blind Welfare Association, SLBWA. Project coordinator for the Caribbean Digital Transformation Project, Francilia Solomon, this week launched a two-week digital literacy training program for blind and low vision clients of the SLBWA. Digital literacy opens doors for the marginalized and at risk by bridging the gap between opportunity, knowledge, innovation, and economic growth. We have the differently able, a large section of our um, population. Um, we are hoping to equip them with the tools to be able to access these services. As we know, some of them have physical and other disabilities. And so it is our hope that the provision of digital literacy training, starting with St. Lucia Blind Welfare Association, will go a very long way in enabling as far and wide members of the population to access this training. The Sir Arthur Lewis Community College has collaborated with the Caribbean Digital Transformation Project in the digital literacy component of the project. We are hoping that this training exercise is going to give you an excellent foundation as you pursue your studies at school. And we're hoping that it helps you to be able to excel, do the research that you need to do, um, be able to navigate the software and the, the, the internet so that you can get information with your assignments, etc. St. Lucia has ratified conventions such as the Rights of Persons with Disabilities and the Marrakesh Treaty, which facilitates access to published works for persons who are blind and visually impaired. Anthony Avril is the Executive Director of the SLBWA. The technology is transforming the landscape for people living with blindness and vision loss. Um, it is enabling us to access a much larger volume of information but not only accessing it, but be able to um, fit ourselves in the society because inclusion is the number one uh, goal for the association. It was truly a proud moment for the SLBWA as one of its vision education support teachers, Jessica Jacoby, was selected to facilitate the training program. As the facilitator, as someone who is blind, it makes me feel very humbled because as growing up as a student, I was not exposed very early to what our students are being exposed to. And I'm happy to be the one to facilitate um, the program. We talk about um, digital literacy, and a lot of times our students are quote-unquote marginalized because they do not have the necessary facilities or necessary um, devices and assistive technology to use. And so teaching them the skills that they will be learning over the next two weeks will put them in a better place to be able to, you know, navigate throughout their education. And I am hoping that it will not end at secondary school, but go further, as well as in the world of employment out there. The Caribbean Digital Transformation Project aims to provide digital literacy training for over 3,500 St. Lucians before the end of the project in 2026. Earlier this month, local vendors were the beneficiaries of digital literacy training. For the National Competitiveness and Productivity Council, Glenn Simon reporting.